how to increase the multifunction display boost pressure scaling on various Porsche models. First we click on diagnostics, then we wait for the diagnostics tool to get the maker model, then we hit continue. You can also do the same process with PUS2 and the launch X431. Um, on the launch X431 you will have to search for boost pressure in the coding option. Next we choose Combi Instrument. We switch to the coding and programming tab. As you can see, didn't have a battery charger or maintainer plugged in, so I just hit next. Now we choose the manual coding without rules option and hit next. Select all the modules. Now, as I said, if you have a launch device, when this list appears, you will see it in English, so you will see boost pressure. Um, but this is uh, obviously all in German, so we have to type in the German word for boost pressure, as you can see I'm doing now. Um, also note, there are two separate uh, coding values you can code. Uh, one is for normal mode, and the other one is for sports mode. Um, as you can see, I'm going to select two. Um, that's both of them. Um, I usually only code the sports mode one, uh, just because in... It just means that when people are looking at the car, they will only see the normal uh, PSI that's programmed at 1.2 rather than 1.6 that you can see in sports mode. That'll make more sense on the next screen. As you can see, normal mode 1.2 bar, sports mode 1.6 bar. Um, just for this exercise, I'm going to change normal mode as well to uh, 1.6 bar. And then I'm going to write. And that's it. That's all you need to do to change the scaling.